it's Marissa and today I thought I would do a tag video. So I chose to do the sweater weather tag. It's a tag filled with a bunch of fall and autumn themed questions to get me into the fall spirit. And I've seen this tag going around recently so I thought it would be something worth doing for my channel. And I think there's, a, I think there's about 13 or 14 questions. So yeah. So let's get started. Question number one is favourite candle scent for the fall and to be honest I'm not really a huge candle burner I don't really burn candles a lot in my room and if I do it's mainly just fresher scents because that's the scent I prefer or maybe like sweeter floral scents stuff like that I know a lot of people like burning like musky scents like coffee scents and stuff like that but, but I'm just not a huge candle burner so I'd say fresh scents. Question number two is tea, coffee or hot chocolate and I would probably either pick tea or hot chocolate from Starbucks. I'm not really someone who drinks coffee because I don't really like the taste of it but I do like frappuccinos so I'd probably have to say hot chocolate. It's super yummy to drink in the fall time. Question number two is the best fall memory I've ever had. Well this is quite hard to pick but I would probably say every year in October before Halloween I go to like this scare attraction where like people are dressed up as zombies and clowns with blood all over them and stuff and like they go around trying to scare you and they go into the different like and they go into like a big haunted house and they're all, and they're all coming out which is kind of scary but I've been quite a few times because I go every year but the first time I ever went I was super scared but it wasn't as scary because I've gotten used to it now. But yeah, I'd probably say like haunted, scary, scary attractions. Number four is which makeup trend do you, do you prefer? Dark lips or winged eyeliner? Well for this one I'd probably say winged eyeliner. Mainly because I don't wear a lot of dark lip colours or even bright colours. I mean, you just stick to like a lip balm. I actually don't own a lot of dark lip colours so... I'd probably have to say winged eyeliner. Number five is what do you want to be for Halloween? I don't know when this video will go up, it'll either go up after Halloween or before Halloween so I don't know what I'm going to be yet. I wasn't really planning on going out on Halloween this year but my little brother wanted to go trick or cheating and if he hasn't got anyone to go with I'll probably have to go with him so I'll probably just do some cat whiskers face paint or something like that. Just something super simple because I wasn't really planning on doing anything this year. But what were you for Halloween or what are you going to be for Halloween? Depends when this goes up. Comment down below. Number six is what would, what do you do to get into the full spirit? Mainly I just let, love layering sweaters, hoodies and scarves with big coats and stuff and wear boots. I think basically the fashion gets me into the full spirit because you get to layer a lot of clothing and all the full stuff comes out in the stores and I just love it a lot. And new trends and things. Number seven is what is the autumn weather like where you live and where I live I get all four seasons so right now it's mainly cold and windy and it's basically leaves everywhere and it's really cold and windy but some days it's just kind of sunny so it's a bit of everything really but on some days it's kind of sunny and warm so a bit of a mixture. Number eight is most worn sweater. I actually have a lot of sweaters but the one I've been wearing a lot recently is this one. It's kind of a grey and white speckled coloured fabric. I think it's really nice and subtle and it goes with a lot of other things and you can, and you can pair a lot of other things with it and it has like this eyelash kind of material which is super fuzzy and, warm. and I got this last year and I'm still wearing it and I got it from New Look and it's my favourite at the next question is must have nail polish for the fall these are the colours I would pick I go for dark nail colours in the fall not really dark lips but just mainly dark colours and these are two by OPI and so Bora Boring Pink this one is upside down this one is lady in black and I just really love these colours and don't have them on right now but I will will have soon. These are really pretty and suitable for fall because they're darker than any other nail polishes I have. Number 10 is football games or jumping in leaves and I would probably have to say jumping in leaves because that is super fun and there's a lot of leaves around at the minute and 
I don't really go like football or go to a lot of football games, so I'd probably say jumping in leaves. Number 11 is hats or scarves. And for this one, I'd probably go with scarves because I wear them a lot more than hats because I'm not really a huge hat wearer. I actually, I don't really have a lot of hats. I have beanies and stuff, but I don't wear them a lot and I wear scarves a lot more often. So I'd probably say scarves because I think they're more easier to style and look good laid with other things and coats. So scarves. Number 12 is pumpkin spice worth the hype. And I can't really answer this question because I've never really had a pumpkin spice latte from Starbucks because I don't really like spice. I mainly just go for the hot chocolate or the tea or the maca frappuccinos. So I can't really answer this question but I will try it and get back to you. 13 is favourite Halloween movie. I don't really have a favourite favourite Halloween movie. I don't really watch a lot because I don't really like scary movies. But the last one I did watch was one called Fun Size with Victoria Justice in it, if I can remember. I'm not really sure, so I'll just say that one. And last but not least, last but not least, what song really gets you into the full spirit? There isn't just one song that gets me into the full spirit because I've been listening to a bunch recently, mainly Ariana Grande's new album, My Everything, and also a couple of Taylor Swift songs. And all about that bass by Megan Trainor so it's a big mixture I don't really have a specific one I just really like what's new at the minute so yeah that is it for the sweater weather tag I hope you enjoyed if you did give it a thumbs up and you can do this tag if you would like to and like I said I don't know whether this would be up for Halloween and jury to give it a thumbs up and you can answer these questions if you'd like either in a video or in the comment section. Subscribe if you haven't already. Again, I hope you liked this video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!